You get into four-minute offense. You get into, hey, we're ahead playing with a lead. You got to be able to run your counter plays. You got to be able to handle the pressures. Those are the things you got to learn to practice during the week, not, hey, we did a great job versus base. Now the game's really tight. We got a chance to win this thing, and we can't handle all the pressure situations from a defense. Nub surface. We'll run the power over here. We'll run some slant pin pull over here. Mimic the fullbacks. Mimic all the shifts and motions so your counter plays come off your base runs. So we're shuffling. Looks like slant. Here comes counter out the back door. These teams that want to run over, they're going to pre-snap, run to the fullback. They see slant or, or any outside zone three or four times. They're going to be quick over the top and late to return. Stemming and moving. Same thing here. It's still rules and principles. Inside gap, man on inside lineman, backside linebacker. When in doubt, trust your rules. And the ball's coming to me, and it's an inside-out gap scheme, not a, uh, inside to backside. Not real pretty here. High knee, puller gets logged. The, the, I'm teaching them, just like the fullback on power. They have got to get their feet across the line of scrimmage. So he knows even if this guy cuts me, I got to lift him out of there and walk him across the ball. Because if we, if we get stuck in the backfield, the log can't get around. The second puller can't get around us. It's a great job by the tailback. A lot of times when this gets logged at the first kicker, this gets wide and it gets bounced to the perimeter. This tailback's a senior, is running a lot. Gets to the hip, gets north and south. Because your wall, all your gap scheme principles stay the same. Your walls are still built, okay? And on the backside, our tight ends on the backside, we'll have communication here, whether we're double funneling, whether we're blasting through, uh, gap seal, you know, otherwise he should have D gap to safety here. So not great communication by these two. We got two on one. Should have at least a hand on the pressure guy. 